Hey everyone, this is Ken, and today we're going to be showing you guys the latest projects that I'm working on as of today. Now, not for nothing, guys, I know I've kind of been out of the loophole, but not to worry, I've been working on these super, mega, huge projects to give you guys the best content that this channel can give you. Now, what we have here, guys, is a medieval mansion. Not to worry, everything I want to show you on this video, I will be making a step-by-step -step tutorial so you can make it yourself at your own convenience. Now, to really give you that sneak peek, guys, this has been a project that I've just been working on nonstop for about a month, and it is a mob farm. It's my latest version. I wanted to create something completely different, something you guys have never seen, and really give this kind of retro medieval slash steampunk kind of look. And I took a whole new approach on to how the style of this mob farm works. And the cool thing, guys, is going to be working on 1.13 and any version of Minecraft that you guys are playing. So it's also a thumbs up because the mechanics behind this is very simple, but highly efficient, which is perfect in my book. And I just love it. Not only that, I wanted this to look amazing, have this in your world, and just no matter what texture you're playing on, this bad boy is just going to look outstanding. It's going to pop out, get this really retro look, and trust me, guys, I will be making a step-by-step -step on that as well, which I'm super stoked about. And to also bring to light, I'm also doing a revamp of the digital clock. As you can see, guys, I've made it more condensed. And as the time changes, I also set up the AM and PM to work just as smooth as well, you see? Look at that. That was phenomenal. Now, I do have this timer a little faster, clearly, because we ain't going to wait 10 minutes for that to, you know, transition. But once you set this up, guys, it's going to work beautifully. And as you can see, the rest of behind it is very condensed and more simplified. So I wanted to work on that to give you something just top of the line. Now, over here, guys, I'm also working on this medieval cathedral. It's been a project I've been dying to create. And I'm going to be also doing a step-by-step -step on this bad boy as well so you guys can have just awesome content, awesome builds nonstop. Now, make sure if you haven't already, guys, to subscribe and to also hit that notification bell so when I post these videos, guys, you'll be first to know. Trust me, it makes a huge difference. And if you give it a like on this video, guys, it really actually does help the channel. I know you probably hear that a lot, but it's actually true. And trust me, guys, it makes a world of difference and it's greatly appreciated. Anyway, I want to thank everybody for watching. Remember to please leave a comment and to click that subscribe button if you want to join. Thank you.